Let's say you want to restore your SSD to factory condition. Maybe you're selling or trading your SSD and you want to make sure that your data is gone from it. Maybe you want like new performance and you don't trust the Windows installer when it comes to leaving garbage on your SSD from your last Windows install. Here I'll show you how to securely erase an NVMe SSD using Linux. This method works even on older motherboards without official NVMe support. NVMexpress.org offers NVMe CLI, a set of tools for managing NVMe devices within Linux. We'll be using the NVMe format command to securely erase the drive. Disclaimer, I'm not responsible if you brick your SSD, erase the wrong data, or otherwise damage your property. Proceed at your own risk. We are also trusting that the manufacturer of the SSD implemented these commands as they claim and that your data will be erased as promised. I can't be held responsible for your data ending up in the wrong hands. So now I'll walk you through the process. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I've booted my Ubuntu Live USB. I'm going to open a terminal. The easiest way is to hit the Windows key and type in Terminal. I'll use full screen to make it easier to see. In Linux, all commands are case sensitive. A program can use the upper and lower case of the same letter to mean completely different things. Keep that in mind when entering commands. The first thing we need is root access. So I type sudo s The dollar sign at the end of the prompt will change to a hash mark and that signifies root access. Next we will use apt to download and install NVMe CLI. So I type apt install nvme-cli that takes a couple of seconds now that nvme cli is installed we'll use the list command to make sure we can see the drive we want to erase by typing nvme list You'll be using the node to refer to your drive with all commands, so pay careful attention to which drive each node refers to so that you don't erase the wrong one. I'll be erasing the Corsair drive. NVMe format will use LBA format 0 by default. This is what your drive should use from the factory. You can run NVMe IDNS to verify what it's currently using. I'll type in NVMe IDNS slash dev slash NVMe zero N one dash H. So we can see LBA format zero is in use. Now let's format with secure erase. Here's where you want to be careful you're using the correct node. In my case, it's NVMe 0 and 1, as I just showed you. You'll use the dash S1 option to do a secure erase. The command for me is NVMe format slash dev slash NVMe 0 and 1 dash s1 if i wanted to use lba format 1 i could add dash l1 but i'll stick with how it came from the factory and that's it Everything is gone on that drive.